Do you know that the only reason the IT band is tight is because of the muscle I'm on is the gluteus maximus and anterior of that is the tensor fascia lata? And the only reason the band hurts is because the fascia between the band has adhered it to the lateral hamstrings and the uh, vastus lateralis and the lateral hamstrings and that adherence of fascia which contains no susceptors is the reason your IT band hurts. And if you put your forearms and elbows and firm rollers in the band, you're increasing the reason that the IT band has a problem. So what we have to do is we have to release and stretch your glute max and your TFL and your glute medius, and then we have to peel that band up and free it from the vastus lateralis. The best thing I've ever done is the massage cupping to free that IT band up from the vastus lateralis. And once you do that, you release the fascial adhesions between the lateral hamstring and the vastus lateralis so the IT band now is not under load. There's no such thing as iliotibial band friction syndrome. The pain at the knee is not coming from the IT band. In that same area of the lateral knee is your lateral clitoral ligament, is your lateral meniscus, proximal gastrox, plantaris, distal hamstrings. There's a lot of stuff in that little area in the back of the knee. When we did our Dallas five-day intensive last six months ago, a female athlete presented with lateral knee pain. No one's been able to help her because she had a distal lateral hamstring that was treated number one. She had a strain plantaris, treat number number two. She had a proximal gastroc strain, treatment number three. She had a fixated fibular head, which means the biceps morse was rotating the fibula. Treatment number four, it was all one session, but there were four things. So a lot of times pain in one little area can be multifaceted. So through assessments, we can treat that. So you don't know what your needs, what's going on with your knee, either one of you.